Now, got the hot water. No coffee in it, unfortunately. Right, put that on top there, so we'll get to it easily. I've got the um, fittings. First off, I'm going to heat this bit of tube up here, like this. I'm going to try sticking this bit on. It's just like a, a pond thing. Oh, we'll get it off if I should. It's off. Oh. I'll put a bit of cream on it real quick. Right, okay. Now I need to cut this. Need a little bit of pipe. Can't you just sort of forget the past? Forget the past, he put us in prison. Try to put you in prison, darling. Okay, Captain, drop the bucket. Yeah, what was he doing? Bringing in illegal aliens, smuggling class A drugs, and refusing to pay their council tax. Oh, so it's all our fault now. Have you ever thought if you hadn't been doing it, the police wouldn't have had a lot of evidence? And have you ever thought, shut up? Careful, I don't want to drop this bloody in. Don't want to put plastic droppings in the tank. Oh, I that? No. From there, I need to put down another piece. Choose. Obviously, it's all the It's so tight on there, you really don't need a duke when you can't. What we need now is a piece to go on the end of here so that it fits onto the intake. So I'll need another little bit now, I'll make a bit from here. 
give it a good soak so I can really push this on hard. Bring a shovel with your boys. Table, yeah? Yeah. Table, table. And there we have it. So, got a piece of pipe there now, which will now, hopefully, let's just not want to lose that pipe. Obviously. That will then fit rock solid onto there. So we poke that through there. Just make sure it's going to be okay. That's going to be fine. Now, more hot water, and a bang of a head. More hot water. And that is 
So this guy is there. Right. I'm going to push that. Right. The way home. and tight. Then the back. Uh, and also uh, on the top. Just going to check the other ones. Right, so there we go. Couple of straps I'm going to put around right in there. I'm doing this so that one can't come out with the other, so to speak. So we need to do that there. What I should do. Let's do a bit here as well, at the back. I'm not doing it tight, but I'm doing it snugly. Yeah. And we need another couple for the other side. So I think the aquarium is nearly up to temperature. Now that is all done. I've got to buy another couple of Jubilee clips on here. So how many do we need? One, two, three. One, two, three, four. Yeah, obviously. Need four. I've only got two there. One of those is which I'm going to be using there down the bottom, so I'll make that a permanent thing. There. To be fair, that tube, I don't think it's going anywhere, but. I suppose Jubilee Clip would be the way to go. I'll get washed now. Mum's going to get washed now. Lovely. Oh, there. Don't try this at home. I'm absolutely sweating now. Ah. Uh, oh, that's a task I have. Can get back to the hell hole now. Just take this. Lovely. Yeah, I suppose. 
suppose that's going to be the way we're going to do this. Yeah, okay. Take this one off here. And now I'm going to put that bait there. I'm only, to, I'm only cutting a few inches off. So that pipe work is just right. I've only wasted about a foot of material there. Right, Jubilee clip. Let's sort of zip the Jubilee clip up. Let's just try on a bit of spare. clip on so I can get to it. Push the check that it's still open yet. Yeah, push this on. Try and get it so it's at ease with the pipe. We don't want any unnatural curves, twists or bends in it. So yeah that's, that seems to be right there. As you can see it's just no pressure it's just sitting as it as it will be right do this up in position. Whew. So now what I've done now, I've got the um, the hoses, intake outtake hoses connected there and we've got the somewhere there got the outlet connected got the intakes connected there and the intake there or the out outlet there so that's all done for a little peaceful recreation looking at the tropical tank well I'll just zip up the ladder again we'll leave you with the tropical tank there for a tip I'll just reposition the intake all the spare tube. Probably end up keeping it and I'll never use it. All I've done there is I've I've just positioned the the outflow. So two well one one is basically point to the bottom of the tank in the corners because I want them to I, think, I, want, them, I want them to stir up the rubbish from the bottom. And then the other one is going along the surface because I want a bit of obviously surface movement. 
I'm going to have me uh, air pump in there, but the boy's nicked it and then he's said he's going to give it back to me. But whether I'll get that or not, I'm not sure. But there, we'll wait and see on that one. Work in progress. Just thinking, looking at everything, making sure everything's okay. <coughs> everything. Made sure there's plenty of tube pushing onto the intakes. Don't want to have to soak up away with them once this is all done. So it seems to be all okay. Tubes. Eight left tubes positioned fairly well. That's, that's that bit of the job done at the moment, I think. God knows what I'm doing next. I suppose I'm going to start putting a bit of slate in now. I've got some slate for the back. And then for the, the top area of the tank at the back, I'm, I'm using um, this, like a 3, 3D background. It's not a particularly brilliant one, but it's it's going to just have a nice nice sort of appearance at the back there, I think. Anyway, let's sit for a minute. There it is. Yeah. Everything in situ there. There's the two filters down there. And there's the tank. Oh, I've got a picture behind there. I better take that out later. I'll see you later.